So if you've ever wanted to try resin, I definitely recommend the dirty pour technique and we're just about to watch how I do that. This is the piece that I made. It's a very easy technique for any beginner. So pay close attention and try this at home. If you'd like some discounted art resin, you can use my code Lame Studio on the Just Resin website. I'll put all the details down below. So I've just finished a workshop and I have all of these random colors and some leftover resin. And I'm just gonna show you what a dirty pour looks like. Usually this board is meant to be primed with either gesso or white acrylic paint. But just for the purpose of examples, I'm gonna use this. With a dirty pour, all you're doing is basically pouring all of your colors into the same cup without mixing them. And this can be done in any random order. All of the drips are going to be reused, so don't you worry about waste.
So this is the dried piece, obviously very reflective. You can see the warehouse ceiling. Um, I'm about to take it outside, but just so you can see what it looks like once it's dry. feel free to message me either here on YouTube or on my Instagram. Thanks, bye.